And hello again, Internet. Here we are with day four of Alien vs. Predator, the classic 2000 version currently available on Steam. It's on GOG and such, and there's actually cross-platform play that way. It's kind of weird to say cross-platform when it's still all on PC, but the thing is, you can do the Steam integrated multiplayer or you can have just general multiplayer. It is something that's just set up as one of the things when you boot it up. I don't know why about that. I haven't actually done the multiplayer on it. Just pointing that out for some of the people who might be interested in this game. Now, if you remember, we're on the third campaign here. We finished the first two levels. There's four to go. And so far, the Predator side is easier. So far. It should get more difficult as things go on. Aliens are a lot dip more difficult to deal with than the Marines are. So let's go ahead and get that going. Starting up the vaults. Okay, and as you see, this is an alien section, so... Actually, right now I'm on my ship. Wait, what? Are you kidding? This is where we ended last time! Like, literally, it's the end of the previous level. Probably don't need to take trophies. Predators, let's go to level 4, stay on maximum alert. The trophies exist for one thing. They don't give you any resources. That's just for... Um... Some of the cheats require them. Okay. Uh, oh, there. Push the button. Push the button. How about this button? Push the button. Break the glass. Open door. Anything. Hello. Okay, is this a door? I can't open it. Let's check other view modes, see if I'm missing anything. I'm not seeing anything obvious here. I can't go back out this way, so... I am stuck in this room until I figure out where the hell to go. Well, I can't break the glass. There we go! Okay, switch view modes. Something a little bit crisper. I do like that about the Predator, the different view modes. That does feel appropriate for the character. Alright, and it makes it a more interesting style of game. Now what do I do? Well, I'm in here. And this looks like another door that I can't get out of. For crying out. Oh, okay. I guess I just keep going through vents. Vents which are difficult to see. More vents. And I don't know why he slides down all the slopes. I mean, seriously. Ah, I'm here in a turret. Come on. Okay. Well, I'm hearing a turret. And I'm in the technology mode. So, if there is a turret here somewhere... Doors are unlocked. Continue with the hunt. What am I hunting? Okay. There we go. The xenomorphs are free. And this is where having the different view modes comes into play. Up, oh, see, that was machine. Which, if I go back to this view mode, highlights that thing. Now, unlike the alien, I can run past that and just take a little bit of damage. Because aliens would get wrecked doing that. Okay, I can't see glass in this view mode. 
Whoa, why aren't you showing up? Hello? Oh, what the? Really? So there's only two view modes that matter. Oh, wait. Do I have the disc yet? No. Oh, I have a pistol, though. And the disc! I do have the disc. Okay, this is what the green view mode is for, really. Because you see that? The disc is stuck. I have to go pick it up. Okay, switch weapons. The pistol is like the shoulder thing. Medical comp. Let's use it. Thank you. Yeah, we got more weapons this time. I guess that's why I had to go to the ship. But let's go to the pistol. Uh, first off, where did my disc go? There it is. So this one sees technology and aliens. So if there's any, like, androids around, this will spot them. And aliens are much easier to deal with when you can see them, you know? No! Oh, get the... Don't know if I got it or not. There. That is an alien trophy. So, what button? Five. Five is the pistol, one is the wrist thing. This way leads deeper into the insulation. I can hear you. There you are. Bam! A good way to kill the aliens, especially if you're trying to get trophies, is to shoot the, pist yeah, shoot the pistol near their feet. As you can see, it has enough of an AoE that that generally takes them out. And it tends to leave the head intact, which you need for grabbing trophies. Oh god, facehuggers. Oh, get off of me! Get off! Now you'll notice also how many more aliens are being spawned on me as the Predator than as the Marine. Because, again, I can take more damage. I'm gonna kinda hide in this corner here, and... Medical Computer. I'm gonna have to quit using the pistol for a bit. No, no, use this! As you can see, you can use that on the run. Wrist blade time. Aliens are faster than you. And they can do enough damage to worry you. Especially this many of them. Okay. But I'm trying to keep my energy up now because I'm going to need to heal again at some point. Something has burnt in the door. Yes, an alien has, obviously. That's what they do. Oh, shoot. That you don't want to play with. You don't wrist blade those things. Whew. Whew. Remember, those things are very frightening. Because they'll kill the predator, too, in one shot. Alright, nothing in here. I'm good enough that I can keep going. I am trying to do the left hand on the wall thing through this maze. I am glad the Predator can see those, because the scariest part about those is uh, when you don't see them. And they nail you anyway. Okay, so I guess I'll go this way now. Oh, dang it! 
got me. Okay, my goal is to take under 100% damage. That's going to be rough. But I could probably do that with the pistol. Stay on blue for now. See, it kills them too. You just shoot it at their feet. Oh, hello! Really? So that side is instant death. It's the other side you have to go down. And what indication is there? None. Hello. That's not where I want to go. Can I get out of there, please? Thank you. That's where I came from. Okay, so... Actually, no. I want to stay on this for now. Break these. Go through the vents. Break that. Go through the vents. So I got the first part of this level figured out now. I can hear that turret, but the turret doesn't bother me yet. Yes. Hello. Hi. And don't bother with a pistol, because I want to save my energy until here. Now, aliens are going to come out. Really? Thank you. Medical Compass 4. Go ahead and use that. Go to 5. Yeah, basically one way to make sure you have the uh, goal in this one is to just never use the Medical Comp. If you can get out without using it, you've made the goal. And, well, if you don't get out, you didn't make it. Now, it would help if I knew where I was going so I could run f and not use up quite so much ammo, you know. I'm going backwards now, aren't I? Yep. I don't have to collect any trophies this time, so I'm not going to sit around and do that. I don't know where I'm going, though. I'm not going in there. So kind of running low on energy. There we go. Let's go through the melted area. And here I was about to switch off of this too. But there's one more of those around. Yeah, see, I'm out of I'm out of energy for it now, which also means I'm out of energy for the medical computer. So this and disc are the two better weapons for me to use now. Installation systems reactivated. I don't know what that means. Can I go through here yet? Yes, I can. Ow. There we go. Let's pick up that energy while I'm here. I have no idea where I'm going. Nope. Now, you see, that filled up my energy again, so I can go back to this. Alrighty, face hugger holding room. Well, that's a very unpleasant place to be.
Is this where I already was? Looks like it. What's over here? Nothing. I am lost again. And that's a nothing. Alright. Well then. That was not helpful. Technically those three died on the same shot. I literally have no idea where I'm going right now. I am completely lost. Yeah, a switch I've already flipped. So... Got plenty of energy. I'm not worried about that. Well, now that I've flipped that switch, now what? Just to break more computers and such? I mean, what is my goal this level? I suppose I could go back up there? Probably should, but I want to make sure I check every single room down here first. Well, there's that, which could be useful later. Stay on this side here. Might as well blow that up. And this is, once again, where the... Oh, there we go! That's somewhere new. Ow! Well, alright then. You know what? Let's heal up, because I'm not going for the goal. Back to the pistol, and let's get moving. What am I looking for down here? Well, another section of cells. Okay, let's follow the blood. Door needs a security pass. Of course it does! Hey, another energy thing. That does make this kind of like a traditional first person shooter. Pre Halo. Oh! Praetor! Those are tougher. Hmm. Unfortunately, that's not where we needed to go. Dang, man! They're getting hostile in here! Still no idea where I'm supposed to go. Using up a lot of ammo. No, that's where I came from. Alright, let's try this again. It's time to go down to either side. Pretty sure I was just in there, so stick to the left side then. Left side. Anything that happens on the left. Fellow warrior has been here. Can I get that? Because I need that right now. Ah, I come around from here? Here we go. More energy! Now, if my fellow warrior has been there, though, 
And he went through that one door that needs the security. Where the bloody heck is the security? And you'll see that this blood is indeed green. So, which is why you can't see it in this mode. Which is weird because I mean, not only it is completely invisible in this mode. Which makes no sense to me, because that's the mode that's supposed to highlight Predator stuff. But I guess it really only highlights the Predator tech, not so much biology. There we go. That was a door. Security pass. Security pass collected. Gotcha. Alrighty. Follow the blood. Yeah, I hear it behind me. Keep an eye out and an ear out for skitters. Is this an elevator? Is that is that an alien? Oh, that's a prey. Is that a prey alien? Oh crap! Is that a queen? Release your brother's spirit. Oh! So that's a pred alien, not a Praetorian. It's dead. Now what? How do I get out? Oh, elevator. Nope. Oh, nearby control panel. Well, then where is this nearby control panel? There it is. Central lift will now get me out of here. This should take me back to my ship quickly, please. I only have 30 seconds. Ship should be straight ahead. There you are. And I'm out. Excellent. You see, that one was a pred alien. So I thought the Praetorians were the Pred Aliens. I was wrong. That was an actual Pred Alien there. And that's when they gave the facehugger to the Predator. Oh. Which is kind of cool. I mean, it would have been a better fight, except for the fact that you're on a time limit. Two more. Fury 161. Now, I like this place. Check this out. Extensive Xenomorph Infestation. Now, I do believe... Well, I'm going to go to red right away. Do I still have the pistol? Pistol, disc, yeah, okay. So same layout as last time. Or loadout. Um, I don't like the fact that aliens and technology show up on the same one. Because that means that aliens, androids, and... um. Well, at least I know where that is. I don't need it yet. But aliens, androids, and turrets all show up on the same view mode, which kind of defeats the point of the view modes, doesn't it? Follow gantries around to switch at top. Da, da, da. Okay, door unlocks. What door where? Do I go back down and look for the door? I guess. Oh, what door? I don't see a door. I mean, I can at least go back and grab that if I needed to, but... Oh, maybe this door. Yeah, that was a door that doesn't go anywhere. Well, that sucked. That was not useful. Oh, that door. Pipe looks weak. Oh, I hear skittering. 
Get off me! Okay, now I go back up through the vent. Well, not through the vent, but there's a fan up there I have to go to. Door unlocks. I think I can hurt myself with the pistol. Told you I heard skittering. Now I want to go back. Oh, now I want to go back and find that under the stairs health or not health. This. There we go. That's not even the right one I was looking for. Oh well. You know what? I don't care. I needed that. Okay. Now where? Oh where was that fan? This way, right? Fan deactivated. I can go through here. Why in the world is there a door behind the fan? Also, this level really reminds me of System Shock. Like, seriously reminds me of System Shock. Okay, well, let's go ahead. Since there's a thing over here, let's go ahead and heal up. Grab that and move on. No, you can die. Thank you. Boom. Must activate all switches in the room. That's one. Okay. Um. I got nothing. Unless that opened this door, it did. Well, hello there! Why don't you just light yourself on fire? That's fine. What the hell were you doing hiding inside a flammable barrier? Hello? Thank you. <sighs> I don't know what that thing was doing hiding inside a flaming barrel, but whatever. That's two. Another door unlocks. I don't know what where, but another door is unlocked for me. Keep going up. Uh, that's the way I came, so there's more over here. Alright. Oh, hello there. <gasps> Go away. This level probably requires a whole bunch of alien trophies. What is this? It's a nothing. Hmm, another splody barrel. Awesome. See, I think the Predator's a little bit overpowered in the single player mode. Door locked. Don't be this one too. Good. Now that door will be unlocked. This is a weird room. It makes no sense to me. Bye. Now, there should be, that's not, that's not it. There was a locked door up here, gotcha. Ah! Stupid spiral staircase. It's my greatest weakness, is the predator. Get up the stairs, up the stairs. This door, this door was locked before, now it's not. Oh, he just wanted to say hi. Okay. No, it's got to be one more switch over here. This is the worst design for a base. Oh, so now I'm going down. I've been down. Oh, 
Yeah, you're not gonna survive that. Okay, enough out of you guys. Okay, you just go ahead and burn yourself. That's fine. Boy, I could use another energy refill here soon. Boy, I could use being able to... Hey, energy refill. No, hit him. Hit him. Okay. Now, I'm going to medical up again. See, I'm betting that the goal here is going to be a bunch of alien trophies. But since I don't know it yet, I don't know. Whatever. I'm just going to run. Try to beat the level. Oh, hello, Sky. Wait, it's gray? Weird. Human and escape vessel has been salvaged. Oh, so I can get in and escape? Everyone's dead up here, every last one. So wait a second, is this Alien 3? Am I in Alien 3 now? Lead smelting plant. Watch out for humans. I am in Alien 3! Crap. Whoa! Hello! You can go up! <laughs> I'll wait for the next one! Not the next one of those, dang it. Alright, now, one of the points of this level, if I can get to it, you're dead. Can I please shoot it? Please, thank you. Now, the thing is, this is a foundry. This is where they're melting a bunch of metal. So the heat vision should be thrown off. And as you see, it kind of is, but not enough. Where? Where is this dude that's throwing these? Oh, he's way over the hell over there. Okay. He's going to kill me. Because I can't hit him. There we go. There! Finally! Holy crap. And now, I kind of want to sit and wait over here. Oh, or pick that up. Perfect. I was just going to sit over here to get my stuff back. But no, if you're going to give me that, I'll take it. Oh, let's go back to the, no, not the shoulder cannon, spear gun. Now, don't touch that or it'll kill you because it's molten, lo no, not lava, but molten metal. And even the Predator can't really survive that. And as you see now, we have to try to balance between the two. Get into the ship. I don't see a ship. Oh, there it is. Good thing I waited instead of jumping off, huh? How come that doesn't show up in Predator View? I'm seriously tempted to save. Because I think I have to jump, and I think I'm going to miss if I do. Oh, whoa, whoo! Oh, cheat enabled! I just had to kill... 44, 40 Xenomorphs. Okay, whatever. I guess that works. Just kill. Alright. Okay, so caverns next. But before I do that, let's see what that cheat was. We've got slug trail, mirror, pipe cleaner, land of the giants. 
Balls of Fire! Oh yeah, Let, let's try this on good old Invasion. Oh, inside Invasion. Let's see what Balls of Fire does, shall we? Oh god! Are you are you dying or are you just fire? You're just fire. Oh, okay. So they have replaced the aliens with fire. And they do the same amount of damage. They're not burning or anything. Oh no, no, it's it's burning. Oh wait, that was acid. Okay, I wonder how this looks for, um... I wonder how that looks with the Predator. Cheats. Balls of fire. Predator... I... <laughs> oh, which one did I start with today? You. You had a lot of humans. I just want to check these things out. I mean, if I've earned them, let's take a look at them. Okay. You show up in every view. Now, are you on fire? Are you actually on fire? If I kill you? No, you're not actually fire. You're just on fire. And you do show up very brightly in every view mode. So, yeah, that's kind of... It just makes them easier to see, I guess. Mind. Nothing wrong with that. Back to the actual game. Cavans. Queen activity detected. Oh my. Do I still have the same loadout? Spear gun, shoulder, metacomp, pistol, disc. Yep. Let's go back to pistol. Straight to red. Need to access underground marine research posts. Okay. Oh, whoa, hello. Okay. Well, then. We are fighting Marines. No problem. Let's actually switch back to... Oh, Jesus! How many of you are there? Are you going to be like the second level where you just keep spawning forever? I was looking for a machine gun up there. Didn't see... Or a turret. Whoa, whoa! You're a nasty one, ain't you? That's okay, I can do this. That was a rocket! You know, I really should not forget that I can... Stealth? Although once they kind of see me, they, they've seen me, so it doesn't really matter. That's the thing, I can basically just do this. And I just went around in a circle, didn't I? Yup. Door opened by device. Now I have to run back around there, don't I? This is another reason why the Marie, uh, the uh, predators just kind of. OP and dumb. Bye bye. I'm standing on your head and you don't know where I am. That was awesome.
Okay, where does this thing go? You need to get down there, but the lift is not going to work. So, can I destroy the lift and just jump down the tube? I'm guessing that's what I have to do. Fine, I'll use the damn disc. No, no, come back. Come back, disc. Or not. Okay, so the disc missed. It's shoulder cannon this thing, maybe? Oh, there it goes. Of course, my disc is gone now, but whatever. Predator's going somewhere. Don't let it get there. Whatever. As if you guys could actually stop me. Let's be honest here. Hi down there. Bye down there. No, I don't know where I'm going. I'm just traveling. It's cute. They think they know where I am. Oh, I'm going in circles! This is frustrating. I don't know where I am. Okay, well, there's this thing again. And this time, let's... Well, I'm not going left, obviously. The problem with the left hand rule, it doesn't work on 3D mazes. Okay, that's what you want. It, getting shot does jerk your view around so that it's not overpowered, you know? Ha ah ha! I pinned his head to the wall! Love it! There we go. Leads to the... Huh. Huh. I love that. I pinned him to the wall so he couldn't attack me anymore. Was not expecting one of those, though. Let me guess. Yeah, it shows up in this mode. Okay. Take you out. Take you out. That thing, I wonder how much damage that could have done to me. Why in the world are there Terminator aliens in this game? Please wait. Don't Please wait. Wait yourself. Yeah, these guys don't really care whether they can quote, see you or not, so self is no... Why am I doing that instead of this? Yeah, just go right through the uh, APC, that works. Still have no idea where I'm actually going, but I'm guessing this is the right way, since I haven't been here yet. That's usually the first sign that I am going the proper direction. Take care of this while I'm here. Uh oh. Incoming. Why can't I get through that? Boy, I could use some more energy right now. There we go. Door opened. And hey, look at that! Oh, Jesus! Yeah, that was a face hugger I ran past. Okay, um, not sure what this is for. At least that door gave me the energy I was looking for. But apparently that opened another door somewhere too, but I don't know where. 
down here. Oh, uh, here we go. See, I can't even use my usual method of, hey, there's still enemies here. I means I haven't been this way yet. Because the enemies keep spawning. I, I, I kind of, I think I mentioned um, Left 4 Dead before, but it uses a kind of similar style. Queen is close. Good prize for her. Good prize for a hunter. So I do have to go kill the queen. God, kill the queen. Praetorian guards. Those are almost dangerous. But no, I'm getting toward the queen now. Um. Whoa! I didn't even see what the special was on that. So let me go t double check that real quick. That's pretty easy. I just have to go kill myself. It's been that long today. Only 45 minutes so far. And then I'm on, the, I think, the last level now. Okay, so kill myself. Does this damage me? Yes, but I think it actually takes... You know, there's an easier way to do this. I fucked your mother! Did you just... Did you just kill your friend? Dude, why would you do that? I mean, I didn't even touch him, and now he's dead. How do you feel about that? Okay, the goal is getting spotted less than 15 times... I got spotted 18. Because the beginning of the game, I got spotted a lot. But it was just basically do what I did. Stealth. Run through the first part. You don't need to fight them. Why bother? You only have to worry about the aliens. Okay, so, speaking of aliens... Battle! Episode 6! Thing Chamber. So, the queen is the boss for two of these guys. Oh, whoa. Spear gun, wrist... Okay, I have a spear gun and a wrist blade. That is it. The rest of my weapons must have gotten knocked off in that. Even the damn shoulder cannon? Really? There you are. Now, you see, the problem here is we got these things to deal with as well. And those are a lot harder to hit when you just have the spear gun. Because that, that'll actually kill you before the queen wheel. And now I can't... There we go. On the other hand, you're mine. Assuming I actually can do damage to you, which... Ow! Ow! Whoa! You a lot more back. Is there any energy refills in... Oh, hello, eggs. Let's kill these things. She doesn't like that. No, I'm dead. My uh, No target for this one, so it's just... Gotta kill her. I'm gonna do this to the face hugger first. There. Now, dedicate this to her. Seventeen. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ow, that hurt. Got it. Oh, come on, get the trophy. Get the trophy. No, nope, let's just kill it. You don't have to actually get, grab the trophy, but whatever. Dead. Boom! Your... Ha ha ha! Yeah, you don't get a sneak up on me! There you go. Your prize. And then you got Invasion, Escape, Temple, Earthbound, and Tiargo, but you need to beat it on Director's Cut for that. Well, there you go. That is the core game of Alien vs. Predator. These bonus missions, they're they are just the other missions from other campaigns that you can play as the other characters, which is really cool. I love that. That's a unique feature for this type of game when, you know, you've got three separate, quote, campaigns, unquote. 
you know, five levels, six levels, six levels, nothing great. It's not a very long game, as you can tell. The It was artificially inflated difficulty by not being able to save, although you can now. So what the hell? Um... You had the extra challenge with the cheat modes. And these bonus levels, like, for example, let's just do this real quick. The bonus levels do also have cheat modes, I believe. And you, as you see, I have a special equipment, the grappling hook, which I don't know how to use. I know I have a button set up for it. I just don't know what it is right off the top of my head. Which I'm going to need to do because I can't get out of here without using the grappling hook. So... What did I use for the grappling hook? I have no earthly idea. Oh, let's find out real quick. Do, 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 grappling hook. Apostrophe. I don't know why it's apostrophe. It's a weird button for it. But these things are only available... Uh, apparently it's not apostrophe. Oh, no! That's not apostrophe! That's tilde, you idiots! But, okay. Well, I was going to check something here, but apparently, um, yeah, there's... Unless I shoot that, I guess. Okay. Spear gun didn't do it. That didn't break it. Oh! Well, there we go. Okay, let's quickly die. Now, you see where I am here. Yeah, just let him kill me. This was the final alien level, was it? Yeah. I don't understand also... Okay, target. No, really? No target. Huh. Oh, it could be a target that I didn't run across yet. But we can try another one real quick. Uh, da 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 there we go, let's do Tarango again. But... I find it weird, like I say, the Predator is the easiest of the campaigns. I guess I'm a Marine... Uh, I guess I am the alien and not the... Okay, there, kill me, kill me. But I guess I'm the Marine and not... Or pfft. words. I don't like the fact that they use the um. No, again, no target. Maybe, maybe there isn't anything for the bonus levels. Okay, let me try saying this one final freaking time. I think it's odd that the Predator campaign, which is the third campaign here, is the easiest. Whereas the alien is probably the hardest because of how squishy you are versus Predator's a freaking tank. Um, I just find that bizarre, personally. Like, they should be reversed. But then again, it wouldn't be alien versus Predator if you reverse the order, right? I don't know. I do like the fact that there's the three different play styles. Um, and the multiplayer mode has those three different play styles, too. It is Predator versus Alien versus Marine, and, you know, whichever one you're better at. Don't think that the, the Predator is going to be a god in the other mode, because the others will do a lot more damage to you than the AI will. Alien is still pretty tough, but the Alien can also hide, except from the Predator, and it's, honestly, Marines get kind of screwed, in my opinion. But then again, they have the guns, and a lot of really good weapons. So, overall, yeah, they're fairly balanced. I never did that much in the multiplayer. I was all about the single player. Um, how do I like this game? Well, I, I liked it enough that I wrote the fa FAQ for it. One of the walkthroughs available is mine. It's a bad walkthrough, but whatever, it worked. So that just tells you how dedicated I was to this game back in the day. And I got all the cheat codes that were available. Some of them were broken in the early release. I don't know if they're fixed now. I'm assuming they are. Um... You know, played through on the hardest difficulty, did all that fun stuff. This game fits the theme. I'm going to go ahead and exit out of this because when you exit, the credits start. 
the game fits the theme. The alien, playing as the alien feels scary because everything can kill you. You want to try to stay hidden, stay out of sight, stay crawling around. The marine side, it plays like a traditional older first-person shooter, hence, hence why you have the health and armor pickups and such. The weapon pickups make sense, health and armor not so much, but this is pre-Halo. Um... Oh, words. It's scarier, though, because, again, things can kill you pretty quickly. Not as quickly as the... as the alien side can be killed, but the facehuggers. Oh! If you haven't watched my fail video, please do so. Because that's where I really did freak out. And you can see, the facehuggers scare me in this game. The startle jump scare where they just, boom, right on your face... And it's game over right away. If you don't know there's one there, and that happens, at least for me, it's one of the most startling moments. And there's very few video games that do that to me. Like, Five Nights at Freddy is built around jump scares, and even that doesn't do it as much as the face huggers. And what's even worse is, like, when I was playing this originally, on the one level where there's the face huggers running around, and there's more face huggers on the hard mode, trust me. And you can hear them skittering about, and you can't see them, and you're looking, and you're looking, and then suddenly, wham! Oh! I've had to stop playing the game sometimes because I just go, oh, oh god, okay, that's it, I'm taking a break. I love that. The Predator in this, it also feels <sighs> overpowered to me. I mean, yeah, it's the Predator. He's supposed to be the unstoppable killing machine like that. Eh? <sighs> See, and here we got the credits for the original release versus the remake and the gold edition. And there's like three or four different versions of this game ultimately now. If you're going to get it, get the same version. It's got the full, it's got everything. And it works on modern systems, plays beautifully, as you saw. It did have a couple crashes. But yeah, this. I wish the game were longer. I do. It's only artificially long because of the difficulty of not saving in the level, which you can do now! <sighs> but the game is what it is. And I thoroughly enjoy it. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. I am taking a break tomorrow, but I will return Monday. I'm only taking one day off. Monday I'm coming back to Magna Carta. And the main reason I'm only doing the one day is because the game's already set up. That's one of the reasons I take the two days, is to try to find and get a game working. I went through five different games before I settled on this one. I'm, I'm not kidding on that. I tried five different games. It's like, no, I can't play this one. No, this one won't record. No, this won't. And it really annoys me, because the whole point of this is I want to show you guys different games. Some of the more obscure ones. And I've done that Steam, but... Some of them just don't work anymore. All right, Internet. Well, that's it for the credits. I hope you've enjoyed. Thanks for watching. I'll see you on Monday with the second string of Magna Carta Tears of Blood. Until then, take care and enjoy the games you play.